My name's Brian Belay, Vice President of Product here at King's Crowd. Today, I'm gonna to take a few quick minutes and just introduce you to the King's Crowd platform and all the features and different capabilities that we allow investors to use. Now, as a reminder again, King's Crowd is the first and only ratings and analytics platform for the online private markets. This is the home page. Now, once you sign up, you're gonna be logged in and you'll either go to the page that you were trying to visit when you first signed up, uh, or you'll come to this company homepage here. This is kind of the page that captures all the different things happening with startups who are raising online right now. As you can see, we have the latest ratings. Um, now the demo I'm gonna be giving today, I do have full access. That's our highest membership tier called Merlin. We do have two other levels that have more restricted access. There's Pro, where you won't get some of the ratings that you see here, and then Starter, where you won't get some of the analyst reports and some other things throughout the site. But for the purpose of today's demo, I'm gonna be showing you what you get with a full Merlin membership at King's Crowd. Now, as I mentioned, we have ratings. Um, we track over you know, hundreds of data points for over 3,300 different raises, currently more than 2,700 different companies who have raised online. Uh, now, in addition to that, we have all these data points and analytics, but we also write analyst reports for a large number of these. That's the analyst report section that you see here, and I'll be showing you that in a little bit. In addition, we track a lot of market valuation trends and different analytics that I'm gonna be showing you from our markets page. And then of course, we have lots of great educational content as well, whether it's industry analysis, market news, education, podcasts, uh, interviews with founders in our founder profiles and that type of thing. So what I'm gonna be showing you are some of the key features and key products just to highlight how to use them so that as an investor, you can make more confident investment decisions in the online private markets. So uh, let's start with the company search table. This is a tool I use myself as an investor when I'm trying to screen for investments. So when you bring it up and you have full access at the Merlin level, uh, you're gonna see that you have more than basically 3,500 different raises here that you can search, sort, filter, look at this kind of any way that you want. So for example, let's say I'm interested in a certain industry, uh, let's say apparel and fashion. Uh, I'm gonna make sure that the status, that it's only looking at active deals, but you can also look at funded deals, deals that were not successfully funded, that type of thing. Uh, and then let's say, you know, uh, if I wanted to filter and sort by platform, you can do that here as well. But let's say that uh, valuation cap, you can put in a certain minimum or maximum. You can look at different security types. Uh, you know, if I'm only interested in equity, for example, uh, and right here, you know, I've basically taken, you know, from, from hundreds of active deals, I think currently more than 600, I've narrowed it down to five. And if I'm interested in this industry and deals that are in equity, I can see all the ones right here at a great snapshot. This is a great way for narrowing down deals real quick, uh, looking at different trends, trying to find other deals that you might want to screen or consider investing in. Uh, now, in addition, just a few other features on this table, you can uh, also hide or show additional columns. So if you wanted to cut it down, you can hide some columns and as well as there are some default columns that we aren't showing when you first come to the page, such as investors and start date. So you can show those as well. So just be aware that you can customize the table. This just hides or shows the filters here. And then of course, if I wanna start over, I can reset either by individual column or all the filters total. Uh, as a reminder, you're gonna get access to all the companies here. You can see them with their ratings. Uh, so any of the companies that King's Crowd has rated, again, you do need a Merlin membership to be able to see those and sort those. All right, let's move on. Uh, another page I wanna show you is trending companies. This is a page that, I, again, I often use because it shows you some different trending companies in different categories that you'd be interested in as an investor. First, you can see new raises. These are ones who are just coming out. Momentum leaders, what are the ones who are you know raising lots of money? Closing soon, right? If these ones are gonna be ending in the next day or two, they're gonna all be shown here. Likely to sell out. What are those deals that are almost at their maximum and if you're, interested in investing, you know, making sure you should check them out. And then average daily raise leaders. So this is another great page that you might want to check, you know, on a daily or weekly basis, come here and take a look. In addition, you know, there are some other tabs. I'm not gonna go into every single feature here today with this demo, uh, but you can check out analyst reports. What are those King's Crowd top deals, deals to watch that our analysts write, you know, lots of info on and do lots of research to be able to provide those analyst reports, as well as founder profiles. When we sit down with the founders of many of these companies and interview them. Often investors will say one of the most important things with their investments is looking at the team. And so we think it's really important that you do get that real good exposure to the founder through these founder profiles. 
All right, let's move on to the next section here. We're gonna be looking at markets. So at a very quick high level, markets page shows you a lot of industry trends. You can look at raise activity over time, valuation trends over time, uh, both average and total. You get breakdowns of security type, you know, SACE versus convertible notes versus equity, and also by platform. And then you can even see a platform rating over time. Now, any of these things, you can change date filters up here to just look at certain dates, or you can sort again by industry, tech sector, even state, security type, or platform. So Markets is another great page you can go to to get kind of that high-level overview. In addition, another key thing that we often see people using a lot are the funding reports. Now these funding reports are generated every week. It's gonna show you what some of the top platforms were for that week in descending order as well as you'll get what the raises were that were very, you know, basically hot, lots of momentum that you might want to check out because other investors seem to be going into those deals. So this is another thing that's very popular. Uh, and again, it's updated every week. You know, something to just be aware of, we are scraping and, you know, connecting via API and scrapers to all these different platforms. So we're updating our data daily. And whether it's the raise amount and anything else, we're going to make sure that we have the latest and greatest details here for you. Again, news is just going to be some market news and industry analytics articles. I'm going to skip over that. Same thing with Crowdopedia. We have lots of great education here, though, so make sure to check it out. Whether it's our podcasts, we do investor profiles where you get to learn about some investors who are investing in online startups, uh, and education, you know, great educational pieces. But uh, one of the other features I want to show you here is my portfolio. Now, once you start finding some of these deals, you know, from using that company search table, you want to start tracking them. And the portfolio tool that King's Crowd has built is really great for that. The only thing I'll say here too is make sure you stay tuned because we are going to have some updates to this in the coming weeks. So make sure you come back and check that out. But you can add any investment. So if I go to add investment here, you can search for any company. Uh, you know, King's Crowd has done some raises themselves, so you could check them out. Uh, and I have a few example investments here, but you can add your investment amount, the date, and then it basically automatically adds the platform, the security type, the valuation, the industry. From this, again, you can get a great overview of your platform. What's the different allocations? What are the different industries you're investing in? Uh, what's the breakdown of equity? But again, check back here because we're gonna have lots more functionality and features coming to this, uh, making this a searchable sortable table and some other great things that you'll wanna check out. Now, in addition to the investment portfolio, we have a following page. And again, there's going to be some more features introduced to this, but this lets you just follow a company. If it's something you're interested in, you want to track. And then basically from here, after you add the company, you can either add it here or from the company page, then you can see how many days are left, uh, what's the latest that they're raising at, and you can track some of the companies here. Now, last but not least, let's actually go and look at one of the key things with King's Crowd, which are these company raise pages. So every company has a raise page. Uh, whenever you're clicking on a company from your portfolio or from the company search table, it's gonna bring you to this page. In addition, you can search for any companies in the search up here and then click on it and it will bring you to their raise page, but you can get a lot of great info. There's three main things you're gonna get on this page. First, the analytics section, uh, you get deal info, basic deals such as you know how much they're raising, uh, what type is a regulation A, regulation crowdfunding, what's the valuation, the security type, and other details you need to know. The momentum tab has some other great info, how many days are left, how much have they raised, what's the likelihood of their max, that type of thing. Company profile is more company overviews as well as an interview. Uh, if there are any interviews with the founders, it will be posted and linked here. But you get other things such as the margin, the capital intensity, the uh, tech sector, those types of things. Excerpt, just an overview, and then financials. Obviously, this is very important when analyzing any company. Uh, so we pull all of this info in automatically from the SEC's Edgar database and from the Form C filings. So this you can get on each page from here. Now, the other thing that you get in the second section, and again, this is for Merlin members only, are the ratings. Again, this is a proprietary patent pending rating algorithm that looks at a whole bunch of different areas of the raise and then compares it with other companies that are also raising. So from here, you'll see there's an overall rating as well as a breakdown in five key areas that you can see here. And then in each of those areas, you can dig even deeper. You can click on any of the price, the market, the team, the differentiators. You can look at important attributes, how many employees, how are the, some of the different ratings and sub ratings falling. In addition to that, you can go to risk. So we rate risk. Where here, it's kind of the opposite where a lower rating for risk is better. So here one is good and five is bad. Whereas normally you want a higher score for the other ratings categories, which is five is good and one is worse. 
All right, and then moving on, last but not least, uh, analyst reports. These are those analyst reports that I was mentioning that are written for any of the deals that we initiate an analyst report for. So the different deals that King's Crab gives out are top deals, deals to watch, neutral deals, and underweight deals. Uh, for any of those that we do initiate coverage, you'll be able to read an in-depth analyst report that goes into all these different areas that can help you make more informed investment decisions. Of course, then at the bottom, we're going to show some related deals. But for the most part, that is a very quick overview of the platform of King's Crowd, of some of the different features and tools. Again, just remember that we're doing a lot of data gathering here. There's a huge database of more than 3,000 raises powering all these different pages and interfaces that you see. Again, with King's Crowd, you're gonna get all this online private market data. You get the Merlin rating proprietary algorithm and these analyst ratings as well. We have a big staff of analysts who are writing all these reports and we're always growing to provide this as fast as possible to you. So again, if you have any questions, feel free to reach out to us, support at kingscrowd.com and hopefully we'll be seeing you soon.